hey you guys welcome back to my channel so today is my birthday so i decided to drop the video of my birthday set featuring the october nail boxy if you did not see my previous unboxing video i will either link it down below or put it up in the cards so you guys can go watch that and then see me use the one two three go system that came in the october nail boxy this month it was the Enel Couture one two three go like a sample kit. It didn't come with the full complete kit, but it came with everything you need um, to do quite a few sets of the one two three go. It came with long stiletto, short stiletto. It came with almond. It came with square. It came with uh, like a beige, pinkish kind of color and clear. Like I made a set of press arms with this kit um, for my best friend. It's on my IG reels and on my TikTok. And then I did both of my hands um, with this kit. Um, only one hand is my birthday set. The other hand I tried to do a Halloween set, but that's a whole other thing. We'll get into that on that video. So um, basically what I'm going to do now is pick out my nail, uh, the ones that fit my nails. Got them all picked out. And I am going to get ready for the application. One thing I forgot, um, and you'll kind of see me go back. With the first nail, I forgot to etch the inside of the tip. So I do go back and do that, but I'm uh, fine. And uh, this primer is like the sweetest thing, you guys. Oh my god. Um, so I prime all my nails, and then I'm going to let you guys watch um, the application, and I'll pop back to you in a little bit. Is where I started to struggle it is so hard to do this on yourself um, the like it's hard to hold the nail in place and then use the flash cure um, to kind of cure it but you gotta hold it or it's not going to cure correctly so what I ended up having to do is uh, prop up my Melody Susie lamp on one side 
um, so that I can kind of stick my hand under it through the side and I would turn it on and then uh, apply the nail, hold it down and then stick my finger under the lamp just to get it to kind of stay. And then um, I went on to the next nail and at the end I just cured them all for 60 seconds once I had them all done. Some of them came out crooked uh, on my birthday set. My glitter finger came out crooked. Uh, I ended up fixing it off camera. I didn't record myself, but I was able to get it off without damaging my nail or the one, two, three, go tip and was able to put it on straight. So that was the only difficulty. Um, it's a little hard to do it by yourself. Uh, it's really good if you have one of those open like small little open lamps that you can kind of use to put your hand in from the side. But I love the flashy cure that came with it. And the reason I love the flashy cure is it made putting my stones on so much easier. I would put my stones on and get them where I want them, flash cure them so they won't move and then go on to the next. And then all I had to do was top coat at the end and put it all in the lamp and give it the final cure and it saved. So I think once I get the hang of this kit, I do like the one, two, three, go system. I have heard so many things about Max and Enel Couture and I was leery of ordering. I do like the products. Um, I'm just a little leery of like wait times, which is one of the reasons why I stopped ordering from AliExpress unless, you know, it's something that I didn't need immediately. So if you've had any experiences with Enel Couture or Max, I want to hear some good experiences because I've heard plenty of bad. If you've had any good experiences with Max or Enel Couture, I would love to hear them. Or even if you had some bad ones, I would love to hear your thoughts. So if I do order something, I can kind of know what to expect and kind of take care of it beforehand. But these tips are amazing. You guys are strong. They're sturdy. I didn't get any bending out of them. Um, the, everything went on so smoothly. Uh, at this point, um, today's my birthday, it's Thursday the 15th. I put them on on Monday the 12th. I have no lifting, no issues, no concerns. I just popped that one off to put it on straight and then that was it. Um, they feel just like regular acrylic nails, um, except they're just, you know, full gel tips. So I do love that aspect. Um, I, it only took me about actually 20 minutes to put all the nails on, even with the issues that I had. And that was putting them on both hands because I recorded um, two videos in one day. So I did both hands. But it only took like 20 minutes to put both hands on, even with the difficulties that I had. So I'm pretty sure once I get better, it won't even take me that long to get them on. And they look amazing. Okay, I'm done talking. I'm going to let you guys float through the rest of this video and I'll come in later.
doing here is buffing the nails to take the shine off so when I put my nail polish on it will go on smooth and I won't have any issues or anything. I had one idea for my set that I wanted to do and I ended up not liking the original color so I went with a different color so that's why you'll see me start to put one color on here in a second and then stop leave off camera for a second and come back with a whole different color.
So now that I am finished painting them all, I've got my little decorations here so I can decorate them. I thought I was filming, filming that part, but I wasn't. So here is the final look.